Good evening, everybody. Just want to show you a little, uh, give you a little tip here for the gardening. See? I tried it last year. We put it, uh, I had put straw, planted my tomatoes, and then I put I put straw on top of it, like maybe a few inches there, straw. And uh, as you can see, I uh, I put straw last night. No, uh, yesterday afternoon actually. And uh, I watered everything, the, the, the green beans, uh, yellow beans and everything. And yeah, as you can see, look at the dirt, how dry it is already. Look, see it? Maybe from this angle you'll see it better. Look, it's a dry dirt, eh? Look, very dry. Not underneath there, but on top, look, it's dry. And the tomatoes, the tomatoes, uh, let's, let's take a peek underneath here, look, look, look at it, look how damp it is underneath there, look, look at it, it's nice and damp, eh, it makes sense, doesn't it, look, Every, even the straw is still wet, I mean, hello tomatoes, this year again. After the beans are up there, I might put straw everywhere. And plus, it's good for the garden, eh? After it compost, it's gonna be great. Hello, tomatoes. Last year's tomatoes, I did the same last year, and uh, I'm not joking, they were up, the, the plants were up to here until uh, it bloomed and uh, the weight of the tomatoes <laughs> on the ground. So I did the same with the beets, the zucchinis, I mean, and the uh, spaghetti squash. So I might get more straw and do the whole garden like that. Anyways, just a quick tip. And uh, take it or leave it. I don't care. Take care, friends. I'll talk to you, uh, you guys back later. Bye-bye.